What's up guys? So today I have a Universal Yums box to open for you. This is their Christmas edition box. Normally it's a, uh, it's going to be snacks from one specific country, but for Christmas it's a, a mix of countries and it's all holiday seasonal type treats. So it's always fun. So let's get into it. Here's their typical uh, top flyer. Uh, normally it'd be like a map of the country it's from. Uh, so it just says, Happy Holidays. Uh, and here we have a list of all the uh, snacks and you can rate them and uh, upload it to uh, social media and they'll things for some sort of contest or whatever. And we have our magazine. So I'll be flipping through that as I go. Uh, <laughs> normally they'd have some sort of uh, like country themed sticker, but this one is a bunch of uh, different holiday stickers that you might put on your uh, gift boxes and stuff. Right up top, I see one snack that I'm already uh, really excited for. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and flip open my uh, booklet though. Yeah, this is from Taiwan. I've had this before, salted egg yolk popcorn. Now, I'm not big on eggs. To be honest, I'm not even that big on popcorn, really, but this is some really good popcorn. I'm really happy to have that again. Next. Ooh, this sounds good. Apple pie cookie bites. Uh, these are from the Netherlands. That sounds really good. Next, we have some uh, kava flavored potato chips. Uh, so, this is more of a New Year's uh, snack, particularly from Spain. Now, I'm not big on uh, kava or wine or really any sort of alcohol, but in potato chips, that sounds very interesting. So, I'm pretty uh, curious to see what that's going to be about. This looks like something that I've had before, maybe not necessarily the same thing, but maybe from, like maybe something from the same brand, just a different flavor. Uh, let's see, what is this? The strawberry trifle flavored bonbons. Oh yeah, I've had lots of bonbons. So. These are from the UK. I like them generally. Uh, I have some more. Potato chips, uh, spicy mustard flavor potato chips from uh, Czech Republic. Uh, I don't really like mustard, so I'm not sure how those are going to be. Uh, next, popcorn flavor truffles. Okay, so the first thing I saw here on pop was popcorn. I feel like pop. I mean, you can get away with putting a couple bags of potato chips in there, but I didn't want multiple popcorn snacks but this popcorn flavor truffles so that should be interesting uh, these are can't see where they're from ah france next uh looks like some sort of gummy possibly a Marshmallow, uh, Joel Must and Butterscotch Gummies. That sounds pretty good, too. Uh, let's see, this is Swedish. So this is kind of like a wine flavor. Like I said, I'm not too big on that sort of thing. I find that a lot of these, uh, like, wine-type snacks actually taste really good as gummy. So this should be pretty good. And I like Butterscotch, so... That should be really interesting. Uh, next, we have some uh, nutty flavored nougat bar from Greece. This looks interesting. Some dark chocolate gingerbread bites. I generally prefer uh, milk or white chocolate to dark chocolate, but we'll see how these are. And these are from Germany. And last. Hopefully not least, we have a uh, mini raspberry Lindsor cake. That sounds really good, too. And these are from 
Austria, looks like. They were originally made in Austria, but they are particularly popular in Switzerland, so funny how those type of things happen, so that's everything. Uh, so these snacks overall sound pretty good. There's maybe one or two that I'm a little bit concerned about, but overall they all uh, sound pretty decent. Uh, so I'm going to kind of take you through the uh, magazine real quick. Uh, so like I said, it does have all the snacks in there. Uh, but one thing that I've always uh, really liked to take a look at is their recipe. I still haven't made a recipe from the last one that I got. Uh, but this is some uh, Danish Christmas cookies. Honestly, they look pretty straightforward. So I may or may not make these. I mean, they don't look bad, but I mean, they look very straightforward. Uh, and you have a bunch of other list of other uh, food items that are popular in other countries. Uh, it's like a game. You know, nutritious facts and information, stuff like that. So I'll say one thing that. Uh, because this is like the holiday box. The magazine is usually a little bit more interesting because it can be more focused on one country, but you know, since it's kind of all over the place, it's not quite as in depth as your uh, typical magazine that you get, but that's kind of to be expected, I suppose, but I am uh, looking forward to trying all these snacks. So yeah, I'll uh, see you when I do my next video.